Hi, my name is Thane Wesley, and I'm doing the monologue Tangled Up in Blue. You know I know this is bad timing. I know you guys. I know you just broke up. But ever since I met you, you've always been with someone. You've always been with someone. Always. And even for the brief moment that you weren't, I was. So we just never, you know. And I know I've had too much to drink. But I need to just finish this. I need to get this out. I need to just get it out. Because the way that... The way that things are looking, I don't think we're going to be spending a lot of time together anymore. I need to just get this out. I need to just say this. I need to just say this and I need to just get this out. And I'm sorry I put you through all this. But for as long as I can remember, as long as I can remember, I've always just been settling. You know? I remember it was probably a seventh or eighth grade, my first girlfriend. She and I would talk in the halls and we would Sit, sit next to each other in study hall and pretty soon she was calling me up and asking me what dress she should wear to the dance that I hadn't even invited her to. And pretty soon we were just girlfriend. She was my girlfriend. And I remember walking home one day and, and thinking like, I don't even really like this girl. She was nice and all. And she, you know, I liked her, but I didn't like her, you know? And I remember all that time ago, even in junior high, just wondering, what if no one else ever wants to be with me? What if... No one else wants to go out with me. Because the offers weren't pouring in any more than they are now. <laughs> I just really thought no one else would want to go out with me. But then I met you at the party. We were just so good together, you know? We were so good together. We were so good. But you were with someone. And you've been with someone ever since. And I've gotten to this point where I, I can't imagine you not in my life. I can't imagine you not being my friend. And you once asked me why the women in my life don't stick around too long. It's you. It's because of you. And because I don't want to settle anymore. I've been settling my whole life and I don't want to do it anymore. And every woman that I meet, every one I compare to you and they're just not you. And I refuse to move on until I know one way or another.
So don't tell me that I'm drunk or that I've had too many and I don't know what my feelings are because I've had four years to think about this. I know how I feel. 